Big news coming out of Zero Motorcycles today with the launch of their 2020 lineup. Zero is one of those brands that I've had my eye on since their launch years ago, and it really grabbed my attention when I was given an SR in Germany for a week to ride. While it was the torquiest bike I've ever ridden, my concerns with the lack of noise in city traffic and the range anxiety ultimately left a semi-bitter taste in my mouth. I think the company's onto some brilliant things, and I can't wait to swing my leg over another bike soon. Now, as for their 2020 lineup, the company redefining the electric motorcycle market is pushing for new adventures by launching the Black Forest DSR Global Model as part of their revamped 2020 base model lineup. Not a lot of big changes are happening across their lineup as they just launched the transformational 2020 SRF earlier in the year. As for the other bikes within the range, all of them will enjoy refreshed colors, graphics, and the power and precision of the Cypher 2 and Cypher 3 operating systems. Complementing the powerful Cypher operating systems, every 2020 Zero motorcycle will possess an updated next-gen app that provides effortless connection to the motorcycle's custom ride modes, charging status, updates, and diagnostics. Now, think of the rest of this video as a bit of a book. In the pinned comments, there will be a timestamp for each chapter, also known each new bike. The first chapter will focus on the Black Forest DSR. So, the Black Forest DSR. There's a lot of talk about here. The first one is that in the press photos, the top box is mounted backwards facing the rider. Now, glad we got that out of the way. The DSR Black Forest Edition enters the US market as the pinnacle dual sport motorcycle in the Zero 2020 lineup. Arriving with a history of riding success overseas, Zero now brings this EU favor to the US equipped with three lockable cases for ample storage, accessory bars, hand guards, and a protective headlamp covers for added protection for the rider and the bike. The DSR Black Forest Edition retails for $18,995 US dollars and is available with various Zero Motorcycles accessories and upgrades for riders to continue to push the boundaries of the dual sport category. Now, Chapter 2, the 2020 DS model. The advances of Zero Motorcycle technology at the top of the spectrum allows for the 2020 DS model to now be available with a 7.2 kilowatt battery for $10,995. The 2020 DS will now sport new colors and graphics in the Mojave colorway and will carry more adventure essentials with its increased onboard storage, making it the ideal option for riders looking to begin their electric dual sport riding. Chapter 3, the 2020 DSR. The 2020 DSR will be available in a new color and graphic styling in black and gold, along with the exclusive 14.4 kilowatt power pack for a price of $15,495. Next chapter, the 2020 FX. For narrow paths and quicker maneuvers, the light and nimble 2020 Zero FX is also updated with new graphics in the Dune colorway and starts at $8,995. Zero's focus on technology and affordability make the 2020 Zero Motorcycles model line the most accessible and capable way to enjoy adventure riding. Now that they've got the dirt bikes out of the way, let's jump to the street bikes of Zero's lineup. Next chapter, the S and the SR. The effortlessly powerful Streetline receives a similar boost in value with the SR being equipped with the 14.4 kilowatt power pack for $15,495. The 2020 SR is compatible with either a charge tank or power tank, and when equipped with a power tank, the SR is the longest range motorcycle available in the 2020 line. Ideal for the first time rider looking for an entry level street motorcycle, the S comes exclusively with a 7.2 kilowatt battery for only $10,995. Next chapter, the FXS. Not to be overlooked, the FXS also has a new look and slate colorway and will be available starting at $8,995. Now, what's my overtake on these bikes? I'm glad that some of the prices have dropped a bit from the previous year, as there's starting to be more competition in the field. Zero is absolutely leading the way in terms of technology, but they need to come out with a bike that will once and for all crush range anxiety. But those are my thoughts. What are your thoughts on Zero's new lineup? Would you ever switch to an electric bike? Let me know below in the comments. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and let me know that you enjoy this type of content for the future. That's it for now guys, go out there and ride safe.